What is going on? It's your boy Warner Brother, and we are back with some more Need for Speed No Limits. It's time to hop into episode 129. Let's get into it. Now, first things first, I want to let y'all know I checked my analytics and noticed that 88% of all my viewers are not subscribed to the channel. So, do me a huge favor hit the like button, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification so you can be updated on whenever I release new content. Also, for more content on Formula One, NASCAR, racing games, and gaming in general, check out some of my previous videos, uh, specifically episode 125, for different channels in the description for those. Also, Big shout out, happy birthday, Dr. Dre, 58 years old, as of yesterday. So, happy birthday, Dr. Dre, 58, getting close to that big 6-0. So, let's dive into the racing action. Also, speaking of racing action, today, it is Sunday, today, Daytona 500, let's go i am super excited i'm gonna try to catch some of the racing action tomorrow hopefully or uh, today uh i'm probably gonna download the nascar app and you know keep an eye on the racing action i will let y'all know who wins the race and some of the action that goes on so let's dive straight in we have our 90 day goal delivery and we have our race skips um, I forgot to make a short about the brand new car. Of course, we got the Honda Civic Type R, 10th gen. Uh, I'm hoping that here soon they're going to bring the new gen Honda Civic Type R into the game. Because I'm going to be real with you, that Civic would be looking spicy. I like the look of the new Civic and the new Civic Type R. It looks like a little bit. Speaking of Civic, we can get blueprints for it, but I'm not going to spend any gold to do that because to me that'd be quite irrelevant. On the other hand, I need money. I need money. I need, I need, I need. So let's actually hop out of here because we're not going to be able to get any materials. We can't do any upgrades right now because our money is minuscule to say the least now, i'm gonna check the store just out of curiosity just to see what's going on obviously we still have a bunch of this other stuff if i had 33 bucks i'd definitely try to go get this uh blueprints for this hennessy venom f5 but right now honestly not worried about it don't really care what i am worried about and what i am caring about is the fact today is sunday and all access is here and we need to get money right away so we got six races to do here in the Fortuned to try to get $450,000 cash money. Because we can't get any more cash money inside the PVPs because I did all the races for the money events. Except for in the breakneck division because we don't even have any cars that are eligible. You know, it's funny. I remember a few months ago when I first got the Viper and I was trying to do these events. How it would be so hard for me to try to beat some of these. But now that the Viper has came so far, it's so easy to just drive this thing. And I'm like super excited about it and everything. So let's continue to roll right along, right, right along, <laughs> right along. <laughs> Jesus, my English is not inging right now. My English is no good. Oh my goodness. Okay. Also, hopefully. 
hopefully here soon I'm going to talk to a friend of mine about doing a possible collab to where I can actually do uh, some music into some of my streams or CV streams into some of my videos uh, of course royalty free music because you know no copyrights here but a good friend of mine uh, from another country actually makes hella dope beats uh, in fact I will try to leave a link to his channel in the description uh, DVF boy so hopefully I'll talk to him about maybe putting uh, featuring some of his music in some of my future videos and across the line more than five seconds left on the clock because that's just how we roll Also super excited about the upcoming Formula One season. Uh, this coming week will be uh, preseason testing, of course, for Formula One. Also, let's go ahead and grab that and uh, restore. Like I said, mostly focusing on trying to get this money first. Because, you know, all about the Benjamin. We did grab the first of five free upgrade crates. I had to think back for a second. So by the time we finish these next four races, the second of five free upgrade crates, crates should be ready. Ooh, Jesus. Could have been a cleaner run. Made some mistakes here and there. I mean, still got the win. Don't get me wrong, but could have been cleaner. Could have had a faster time. But it's fine. I'm just. I am happy that I did win. Yes, I do try to be a little bit of a perfectionist, knowing that it's never going to be perfect anyway. But still, I try to be as you know, um, I try to be as, um, detail-oriented as I can when it comes to my driving on this game. Try to be very finite with my actions in the game. Oh, beautiful launch out the line. Look at the moves. That was a really quick run. Is that a sub 37 second run? That was a crazy, ooh, just over 37 seconds. But we beat the entire field by over five seconds. That, that was a God tier run right there. That was like Jesus literally took the wheel and just drove for me. That's how good that one felt. Jesus took the wheel and just drove it with absolute precision and grace. That was a good run. From start to finish. Honestly, I, it's rare to have a, a run that was that clean, that flawless, that just perfect. It was a perfect run.
I'm getting a lot better with these launches on this Viper. And these Viper is having some hard launches. Whoa, getting close to that wall though. Uh, start to build. Ooh. Cross the line. Ooh, is that the same time I had last time? Yo, I think that was the exact same time I had last time. Oh my god. That's what you call consistency. Of course, I've had a faster time than that before. I think this episode is mostly be about consistency, and I like that. I try to be consistent with these races. Speaking of consistency, let's try to have a cleaner run this time. Yeah, this is a better run. That was better. A second faster, too. Now that's how you capitalize on a good run. You could you clean up your driving style and you can gain at least a second. You know, in fact that's the gain I made in that last run. Made a full second gain there. So alright, so let's go ahead and grab the second of five free upgrade crates for the day. Intake. Do I need intake? Hmm. Also, let's go ahead because we need one of these. I'm just going to switch that. Alright, so let's go ahead and buy all this. Well, I need one there. I need two for the Viper? I did not know that. I need 12 of these for the McLaren Speedtail. One for the Pontiac. I did not know that. Intake, I just grabbed one. Oh, I don't need any more of these. So I'm not going to get them. Oh, I do need one more of these for the Ken Block car. For the Ken Block Fiesta. So here's what I will do. Let's go ahead... I'm only doing this just to get rid of it because I don't need it right now and I'm just gonna go ahead and just you know I'm gonna basically just you know do it just because so put that there put that there you know, and I know I'm wasting my m money but I'm also making sure that I can at least get that assignment complete which is you know beneficial also it's not bad what I'm doing with that so let's go ahead and scroll on over we're gonna work on this RX-7 some more and for that we have a couple of rebuilds here so turbo is at its maximum. And then engine. Oh, I will need a piston here pretty soon for this car. Put a block there. Oh, I didn't. Well, I'm going to need one. 
I'm gonna need an intake now. Alright. Damn it, I was supposed to work on the career, wasn't I? Well, honestly, there isn't much left to do to this thing. I, I just need two batteries, which I'll go ahead and get the two batteries for this car. I'll spend the gold this time. Just so I can just go ahead and max that out. And I need one here. I'm, I'm, I'm actually going to go ahead and buy just one battery. Okay, solenoid. I need two. Okay. I'll race for those. Okay, blow off valve. Damn, I need two for a lot of them. I'll buy the one here for whatever car that it needed. I'm gonna see which car needs it first. Like one of the whichever one of the higher end, because I know the charger needs it, but I'm not going to put it in there till I see what other car potentially will need it. As far as I know, that's the only one that needs. Oh wait, 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 wait! No, that's rebuilds. So that's a rebuild, ain't it? Okay, yeah, that's a rebuild. So I'm not worried about you. Also, still up for debate. Uh, you know, like I said, uh, comment uh, on the poll for what color you want this Ford Model 18 to be. Again, we're using candy colors. You know, candy paint with the white on top. Anyways, candy paint with the white on top. Got that song stuck up in my head. Okay, so really it's just that one. Also, what's this? Gearbox. Oh! Drive shaft. You need that. Wonderful. Well, oh, that's good to know. I had to put that there. Also, my money is diminishing quite quickly. Um, not you, but you. So, might as well go ahead and put that blow off valve into the charger now. And we'll deal with anything extra a little bit later. Looking forward to getting nine more blueprints for this charger so we can get it up to five stars. Maybe start doing some actual customization to the damn thing. I am going to try to do. Uh, I know, I know this is going to be hella cliche or whatever the case may be. I am going to try to do the Fast and Furious build with this charger, but have my own sort of spin on it, if that makes sense. I also forgot to put that intake in there, but that's fine. Now, I know I need two for a bunch of these cars. So I'm going to go ahead and get one for the Carrera. And I think that's the money that we'll spend for now. Also, damn. I spent a lot of time just working on cars. But then again, I normally do that, so I'm not surprised. Okay, so RX-7, we're going to go ahead and not worry about the charger. RX-7, let's go ahead and put... I'll come over here so I can put that in there. I am going to get a piston. Put that in there. The two flywheels, I'll race for those. And definitely going to put this into you. There you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Damn, the thing, the thing that was four hundred fifty thousand dollars. All that just went down the toilet. Just, just gone. Just, just 
down the drain. So damn quick. Um, let's go ahead and grab the third. Or is this the second? Second or third of a free upgrade crazy. No, that's the third. Okay. Hmm. More blueprints. More scrap. Very nice. Also, okay. So let's go ahead and actually hop into the... I want to say car series. Let's do car series. Do car series for now. We'll come back to do more tuna trials after the PVPs. We're not going to do any campaign replayables uh, for this episode. Alright, so time trial. Let's go ahead and do that. So we can get our gold and whatever else we need. Oh, jeez. No, my eyeball is just hold on. All right, here we go. Definitely didn't get the launch I was looking for. Still trying to get used to this GT500. Two fifteen top speed without nitrous. That was actually a pretty quick run. Uh, not the cleanest, but damn quick, very damn quick. All right. So that's chapter one complete, and then of course we still have chapter two, which we can go all the way through. Very nice. And we have two rush hour races. One with, oh, more blueprints, and one with more money. I just want to take a look, see what's coming up. Oh, more blueprints, and more money, and more money. And more blueprints. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. And more money. <laughs> uh, why am I not surprised? I do like the fact we get a consistent amount of gold after completing each chapter, though. At least, you know, that's, you know, good enough for me, in my opinion. I feel like by the time we get, like, chapter three, chapter four, we'll probably have enough in order to get this Shelby uh, GT500 to four stars. Fingers crossed. Of course, I would like to get further than four stars, but four stars, I feel like, would be a very good midpoint, you know, and it will allow me to get the highest rated parts for this car. Of course, granted, I get enough scrap points or get lucky with some certain races and all that. Again, not timing the launch pretty well. So we have a good battle here. We have two Carrera Porsches versus two Mustangs. Of course, my Mustang older than the other Mustang. But still got a battle going on here. Woo! I was about to... Cross the line. Did give that Charger a good tap, though. Using uh, the rear of my car. Not on purpose, but you know, these things happen. Oh, eight more. Right, one more rush hour race to round it out.
All right. Across the line. Pretty decent time, actually. Also, I did finally make that poll on which uh, sport class car you want me to work on, which would be the 991 Carrera or the R35 GTR. So, go ahead and start making your votes now. Voting will end in a week uh, in a week's time. Of course, the purpose of me working on a sports class car is to try to get it up to 850 so we can continue on with chapter 21 of the campaign against Ajax where you see right up there this gentleman right here that little piece of dookie breath um, actually while we're here let's actually go ahead and hop back into the tuner trials because we do need some engine materials but before we do I noticed that. What, what, what's going on there with the crankshaft? What car needs a crankshaft? Probably one of the higher up cars. I'm not sure which class it would be in. Actually, let's go ahead and break that down. Hyper class. Couldn't be the Hennessy, right? No. I'm kind of sort of going through it. What's this? Oh god, that's... Oh! Oh, that's expensive. But it's taken care of. <laughs> it's expensive, but it's taken care of, so I ain't worried about it no more. Okay. So it can't be... And it can't be the Bugatti. It can't be the Bolide, right? Yeah, it's not that. Alright, let's check the supercar category then. Oh, I think I know which one it is. I think it's this one. Yep, I was right. Of course, it's the Cayenne Turbo GT. Okay. Um, also, do 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 do. Okay, engines fully built there. Damn. Catching some quick loading screens. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, I still need a turbine. Oh no! Damn, I st I still need certain materials for this unicorn. I didn't even realize that I needed. Damn. Well. But then again, the unicorn isn't my main focus. Even though I do want to get it maxed out, you know, so I can have it maxed out. Also, that model 18, I still need to get that maxed out as well. Now this Falcon XB Coupe, we got it up to four stars, but all of our parts are still in common. We're not even in the epic category yet, and I do want to try to get some epic parts for this car. Hopefully, soon. I, I might do the A-hole move and steal some from the Charger, put it into the Falcon, but again, that's more of an a-hole move. I kind of don't want to do that. I mean, I could. But again, don't want to do that. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Meantime, I do know I'm going to go ahead and do these. This will be for the... Um, that will be for the RX-7. Yes, that'll be for your RX-7.
Damn it, I was trying to avoid the traffic car. I I didn't move in time. Damn it, that's twice. Cross the line. Could have been a much cleaner run had I not crashed into so many cars. Trying to get more near misses, but, you know, that just didn't work out according to plan. The only one deep in that's, you know, well into the 42nd range. Everyone else is in the 52nd range, so. Kind of put me out there. I am going to go ahead. Oh, yeah, I did say I was going to do that. And then we'll do some of the other ones tomorrow for the engine. We'll do the, some of the other ones tomorrow for the engine. Uh, we'll get the crankshaft tomorrow for the Porsche. Things of that nature. Cross the line under 25 seconds. Pretty damn good time. All right. So that's taken care of. Um. See what else? Cause I'm thinking about doing turbo stuff. Oh, I did need the turbo stuff for the Hennessy, but of course I don't have much money. Okay, Arc Seven engine. That. Put that in there. really do dig this RX-7. It's got the Rocket Bunny kit on there. Looks good. Looks really good. So, turbo stuff. Let's go here. Click there. And turbo. So, two blow-off valves. So I'll focus on that. Turbo materials and blow off valves. There you are. Give me some of this. Give me some of that. Give me some of that. Give me that stew stew energy. Alright, this race, I'm going to be kind of an a-hole, because I'm going to bring the Porsches to the front. That worked. I didn't do that right. Ooh, 42 seconds flat. Despite the, you know, dirty driving. Oh, I still wasn't able to get the, I was still wasn't able to get beans up there, damn. Oh, he was close though. Maybe he got past at the last moment. 
Uh, that could be the case. He got probably passed at the last moment and just wasn't able to maintain it. 12 races won. And I still need one more near miss. And apparently one more fuel used. Or two more, excuse me, two more. Hmm. The Bogan Shogun. So, I'm going to hold on to these blow-off valves. When I come back from the PVPs, we're going to do some more uh, tuner trials, of course, to finish out the all-access. That was honestly impressive. And across the line. Haha, <laughs> Porsche's to the front. Alright, very nice. Mmm, yes, I am out of fuel. Now, before we continue on, we do need to grab the fourth free upgrade crate of the day. But before we do continue on with that, there's some stuff I need to salvage. So, like, these, I don't need these. I definitely don't need these. Uh, get rid of those. Get rid of those. And I believe that is everything. I still need one more back plate. So we can scrap all that. Get that out of my freaking storage and all that. Now we can go ahead and grab the fourth of five free upgrade crates for the day. Just grab that. Snag that. Thank you very much. Zip, bam, boom. Hey, a battery! Oh, that is perfect. Cause I was getting ready to buy one, which I still need to buy one more for the 993. And oh my goodness, that is a blessing. Let's go ahead and put that in. Go ahead and take care of that straight away. That's gonna cost me quite a bit, huh? Oh, not that much. I still need more money. Still need more money. Uh, rebuild, not worried about that. I am hoping that I can get another battery. You know, soon. So I can do this, max this out. That'd be great. Okay. I did want to check something else in the car series real fast. So. Which one is it? Not you. Uh, not you. Did I beat? I think I beat that one already. The call 911. Because I don't see it on here anymore. Yeah, I don't see it on here anymore. So that means I must have beaten it. Maybe one way to find out. Completion. Performance. Jiroku. Boss in general. I did beat German Precision. Uh, I did beat Sport Classics. Where? Yeah, I did beat the 911 one. Okay. Good to know. So, let's hop into the PvPs. We still have over 12 hours left. 
and we have plenty of racing to take care of today. So back into the speedster division. Let's see if today we can try to get five straight wins. More than likely not, but we are going to try our hardest. But it's not going to be easy because we still got those Falcons that we're going up against. And those Falcons are proving to be very difficult, to say the least. Ooh, oh my god. I was about to say, it's such a good looking car, and then fitment. Outside of the fitment, the way that it looks, because it looks like a proper NASCAR race car, I'm going to give you an 8.3 out of 10. If you have fixed your fitment to where it's like functional camber, like on the, my Porsche, you would definitely have at least a 9. So now I'm hoping that I beat you. Oh, you lost nitrous. He lost nitrous. But he gained it right back and he is pulling. Oh, I'm pulling on him. I'm pulling on him right across the finish. Wow. What a run. Jesus. That was almost a personal best. <laughs> that was crazy that was my first win against the falcon that's like higher up wow okay that was fast that was fast i was not expecting that i mean we got the win and yes but damn that was quick all right another cayenne turbo gt and i'm not feeling confident here I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try my best. So, ooh, they changed the color on it. It looks good. They they got rid of the silver, put it on like a cream color. It looks good with the cream color mixed with like the brass wheels. That looks good actually. Oh no, I lost my nitrous. He lost his too, but... Wait, I'm gaining. Whoa! Okay. So I figured out how I need to do this race. So basically, perfect launch. Nitrous off. Catch some more nitrous, nitrous off, catch the nitro strip, then use the nitrous after you run across the nitro strip just so you can maintain your nitrous throughout the rest of the race. And of course, avoid traffic, things of that nature. Okay. Oh, now that I got a plan on how to win, let's see if that we can continue to execute. Uh, but we're on a different course now, and what's up with these Falcons and these terrible fitments? Like, it looks good except for the fitment. And the god-awful roof spoiler, bro. Like, seriously, you're at a 6.8 out of 10. Alright. Alright. I'm actually gonna wait till I land. Jesus, he's gone. Oh wait, this is the ESF one. No, it's not. I thought this was an ESF race. I was bouncing off the walls quite a bit, but that's fine. Seems like they made quite a few mistakes. Uh, that's, apparently, that's the reason why I won that race. Because honestly, I thought I was going to lose. Because, you know. 
810 PR versus 760 something, almost 770. Again, my confidence level against these Falcons, even though I have been winning, my confidence level against these Falcons are not that great. Now, this one looks better. I just don't like the wheels on it. But other than that, this one looks a lot better. And, of course, they put that ugly-ass roof spoiler. What m possesses them to do that? I have no idea. They must have not. I got a good launch there. Considering how I was able to maintain that. Oh, no. I'm not winning this. Yeah, I lost my nitrous and I thought I was going to maintain the nitrous, but I didn't. So it killed me. Of course, even if I did my personal best, I still would have lost. So that's just the price I had to pay for that one. But let's see if we can at least get one more win to try to at least elevate us as close to it as we can before we try to Tasmanian Devil. Great. Before we try to um, grab the final free upgrade crate of the day. Now that's clean. I like that. Kept the original paint. Still looks good. It even has like that Mad Max style. Don't have that ugly ass rear uh, roof spoiler. 8.6 out of 10. I dig it. Another really good launch here. There we go. I think I got it down. Nitrous. He lost Nos, but I was able to maintain it. Oh, a new personal best. A sub 22 second run. Now, see, if I'd done that the last race, I would have won. Damn. That was fast. 21.99. That was a new person of the best. And honestly, that was my best run out of this car. This is, that was phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. Honestly, I couldn't have asked for a better run than that. All right, let's go ahead and grab the final free upgrade crate before we hop back into the PVPs and try to race some more. Now, we do have pressure plates right there. So that's another assignment complete. We've been doing pretty good with these assignments, to be fair, to be 100% honest. All right, back into the PVPs. We still, we still got to try. I want to try. I, I got a groove for that particular race, you know, and I'm, I'm in the groove. I feel good, you know. I've actually been kicking some tail against these Falcons, but you know, I feel like I've been getting kind of lucky. But I do want to try to make it into A tier. I want to get into A tier. I want to get those premium crates. I don't like the fact that I'm racing against another driver in a basically bone stock looking falcon and something else I'm noticing notice where the driver's sitting last I checked the Ford Falcon was an American car but also they sell them in Australia so that makes sense as to why it's right hand drive so never mind I'll shut up Oh, this is the ESF race. So great. See, you hit your night just midair. That's not how you do that. I think he got hit by an ESF right there. Across the line, got the dub, barely. Of 
and, but a new personal best. So that means I really had to drive with some extra precision in order to get that. <sighs> a tier. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Breathe. Focus up. Another stock looking falcon. Great. Whew. Okay, I managed to get the launch I'm looking for. Oh no, that's not gonna help. That's not gonna help. Okay, he lost nitrous, but he's basically taken off on me. Yeah, I'm not winning this. Made a couple mistakes. That costed me. Damn, even with a personal best, I just said wasn't going to beat that. Okay. Focus up. Let's keep going. I'm going to try my hardest to get an A tier. It'd be nice if I actually had a Falcon that was competitive, but I don't. Ooh, now that is badass. Not too fond of the wheels with this one, but that's badass. You don't have the ugly roof spoiler either. Looks damn good. 9.3 out of 10. Oh, well, way to waste your nitrous, sir. I saw that. Oh, he got hit. He got hit. He got hit. Capitalize. Capitalize on your opponent's mistakes, exploit their weaknesses, and win. That is how you win. Of course, I made a couple mistakes myself. I definitely went kind of wide there towards that second area where the jumps were. But we were still able to maintain. Okay. I've driven against this person before. Tommy812? I, yeah, I recognize the gamer tag okay at least this one isn't completely stock you change the paint so you know kudos to you on that I, I mean it still looks stock because you know it looks like a normal Falcon obviously it's not but Oh boy, this guy is quick. And he knows the driving techniques. Ah, messed up right at the end. I, w I went wide trying to avoid it. I shouldn't have done that. Set a new personal best, but I really messed that up. If I went wide, then cut in, I might have probably would have beat him. Damn it. Come on. Oh, we are going to keep rolling with this until we get it. So. Six more tries. Come on. Let's at least try being Sam 1984. All right. That's a pretty clean looking one. Again, not too fond of the wheels, but it looks good. Please tell me you don't have the ugly roof spoil. Okay, thank God. Okay, I managed to get the start that I wanted. Let's try to maintain the drift. Okay, you're right behind me. Okay. 
Alright, 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 alright. Whoa, Jesus. I was quick. Couple of little mistakes here and there, but you know what? We still got it. It'd be nice if I head back to this track to try to do my race that needs to bump me up. Five citizen. Uh, I think this is the one with the ESF again. It's not. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I like that. That looks good. Okay. I, I dig that. That's a 9.7 in my book. Yeah. Almost a 10. I'll give you a 9.8, actually. Okay, man, to get the launch. Run my race. Run my race. Did it! Let's go! Oh my God, we did. We made it an A tier. Let's go! Let's go! Oh yes! Yes! Let's go! Oh sweet Jesus! I was driving so damn hard for that one. I was driving so damn hard for that one. Let's go. Okay, so I did see that we got a sports gearbox. Mm, and I'm thinking that the what you call. Because let me look at this. I don't know how I feel about that. Let, oh, let's look at some of the stats here. 70, 50 for top speed. Okay, acceleration is not looking great. Let's look at this. Let's look at the uh, Cayenne again. Okay, the numbers definitely aren't good here, so... I think I'm doing right by using the right vehicle for now. But as far as gearbox, yeah, I'll go ahead and swap it. Wait, 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 wait. Where's my R35 sitting at? Three stars. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that because I kind of sort of want to go ahead, put this in there. It's not going to bump it up a whole bunch, but I can at least scrap this. Give me some scrap points. And, ooh, I already have that. Well, that's good. And I have those, which is good also. Okay. That works. Of course, I just don't have the money, but, you know, it's fine. That being said, let's hop out of here and back into the tuner trials. No, nope, let's do four more PvP races. <laughs> let's, let's do four more PvPs. So we are in A tier, finally, in the Speedster Division. We have been just driving the wheels off of our wagon. Huh. Yuti. Hmm. By the way, yes, I do understand Japanese. Oh, but only a little bit. You know what? I really dig this Falcon. 10 out of 10 for this one. Ah, I spoke too soon. I saw the roof spoiler. Damn it. Ah. 9.4. 9.4. That roof spoiler. That roof spoiler killed it.
Jesus. Damn it. I was trying to avoid that. I was trying to avoid that. If I had not hit, I'd probably be right with him neck and neck, but alas, I screwed that up. Luckily, it's not going to drop me back down to B tier, which is good, but you know. See, if I'd done my personal best, wait, I don't think I did a personal best with this car. At least I don't think they did that. If I did, then yes, I would have beaten him, but because I hit the cop and it screwed me up, so, but it's okay. Honestly, I'm just happy that I even made it into A tier, period. Yeah, let's go to a different track, because that one... It, that one's a hit or miss track for me. This one, at least I know I'm consistent. Uh, God, I really hate these sleeper cars, man. Add, add some, you know, color. Add, add some, you know, wheels, something. Damn. Ooh, I almost didn't get that launch. Maintain. I'm going to lose my nitrous here, yep. Okay, we both lost NOS. I knew I was going to lose that as soon as I lost my nitrous, but it's fine. And he hit the wall hard right at the end. I heard that. Now, see, if I hadn't have lost my NOS, oh, yeah, he would have lost. Not going to lie to you. I'm going to keep it 100% real. You, sir, would have lost. You, sir, or man, would have lost if I had not lost my nitrous. But it's okay, because at this point, I'm happy I made it into A tier. I did what I set out to do. I know I'm not even going to get close to S tier, because I don't have a Falcon that's maxed out at 810. I don't even have a, K a Cayenne that's even close to getting all the stuff that it needs. This doesn't look bad. It's just a rear camber. Correct it, please. Fix your fix fix your rear camera, sir. And roof spoiler. Oh my God, you did terrible. A seven point one. I like the color. I like the fact that it's low and it's wide and it looks good. And wow, you were late with your nitrous. Oh, this is going to be a race. Oh, he got me right at the end. That was good, though. That was a good run. That was good. Right at the end. That was good. Quality racer. If I'd done my personal best, I would have beat you. But good run. Good run. Honestly, not, not upset that I lost that one. That one. Well-deserved race win for that guy. Well deserved. B tier? Are you kidding me? Scorpio Venom. A Scorpion Venom. Sorry, my bad. Hmm. Pretty clean, actually. Let's see if you have that terrible roof spoiler. You do. Oh my god. Ah, uh, six point seven. Because I'm also docking you for your wheels, but... Ooh, I almost didn't get that launch. Wasting nitrous again midair. Come on, y'all. Let's try this. I got hit by the ESF and I still won! And I still set a personal best! What is that? I got hit by the ESF, I still won and set a personal best. Come on now. Can't tell me. How? Uh, how? 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 I, I, I don't understand that. That's crazy, yo. That's crazy. Alright. So here's what I'm going to do to give it a proper send off. What we're going to do here is we're going to hop into the campaign replayables because we are going to drive a car that we haven't driven yet. 
I think you know where I'm going with this. I, th I think you know where I'm going with this. I think y'all know where I'm going with this. Possibly. Hold on. Let's see how much for the next one. Okay. Let's go all the way down the list. Right here. Honda Civic Type R. We've never driven this car. Well, I have before. But in this save file, I have not driven a Honda Civic Type R. Actually, no, I lied because I think that was one of the delivery races during the campaign. So I think I have driven one of these before. But this would technically be the first drive of this Honda Civic. And I'm going to cut my mic so you can enjoy this run. All right, that was absolutely, actually a pretty good run. I felt like I could have got more hang time, but, you know, can't have a perfect run, I guess. So let's just go straight down the middle, and, of course, we get a fuse. Why wouldn't we get a fuse? Some people would be confused over it, but, okay, that was a bad joke. All right, so that's 20 fuel used. Alright, to round out the video, we are actually going to go ahead and hop into the tuner trials because I do need to grab some um, calipers. So that will be my main focus here, would be the calipers. Of course, yes, those calipers will be going into the Handy Steve Van 5. I still need to get some more money, but we'll get that taken care of here in a little while. All right, Porsches to the front. Time to put these BMWs back in their place. Damn, I still couldn't do that. Y'all saw that, right, Virgin? <laughs> I wasn't trying to be too dirty with him, but damn, he tried to send me into the wall, but guess what? You got wrecked, sir. Now, even despite that, still managed to do a sub 41 second run. Damn, and look how close everybody was. I still wasn't able to get the other Porsche, you know, up a spot, but hey. Also, still need one more uh, fuel. Think that'll be ready here in a moment. Um, before we continue, we're we're gonna do that final race. That is a given. Just wanted to. I kind of want to go ahead and um, hold on. Oh, would you look at that? Put those in there, might as well. Okay, well that's ready to be rebuilt. I, I've been kind of sort of avoiding this car a little bit, not on purpose, but also not an accident, so. 
Ah, two fuses. That'll help. Wonderful. I, I have been kind of sort of avoiding this card, mostly because of the fact that I'm not using this for any car series. I'm not using it for the PvPs, so I'm not too focused on building that one. That and the Hakoska. I haven't been too worried about building those two cars up. You know, of course I will. It's just, you know, one of the things where I need to get my funds up, of course. You know, I'm still in the five-figure range right now. And then, of course, being able to have the time and the materials to work on that. So, let's go ahead and finish this out with this final race. And it's the same race, so... Third time's the charm, Porsche's to the front. Try a different strategy here. That worked. Yes. Follow me. Stick close. Oh, you dirty driver! No! You dirty Sanchez! Oh, that SOB. I'm gonna destroy him now. Oh, he's going to get wrecked. I'm going to wreck him. Next race, I'm going to destroy him. I'm going to go solely after that BMW. Oh, yes, I am going to get back what's rightfully mine. Oh, I am. Oh, I can't even. Oh, yeah. No, I can't do that race again. Duh. Oh, but they're going it down. Gingerati, you are done. I'm going to destroy you. I'm not even worried about getting that other Porsche up to the front now. Come on, try me. Oh, no, the hell you don't. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Yes. <laughs> Freaking still trying to take me out and bully me. And I still beat your ass. Dirty piece of trash. Damn, look how close everybody was, though. That was a close run. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. That's enough drama and action for one day. That'll wrap it up for this episode. Tune in next time for episode 120. Uh, sorry, 130, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, thank y'all so much for joining. Like and subscribe for more content. Again, for other content, I'll leave... Uh, check out episode 125 for different channels in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much. Much love, much appreciation. Let's go over to this Hakoska. It's your boy Warner Brother, and I'm out. Peace.